The NEO stock did 51% in six days. 51% in six days. This screams foreign stock investigation and this is what we're doing right now. All right, so what we are dealing here, why it works that NEO stock went up so much high. Let's first dive into the chart or, or the stock of NEO, right? I mean, the last week was pretty awesome if you're asking me because we just gained 24% and uh, you know, the 51% in six days was from the 20th of August till the 26th of August, which was, you know, 51 till 53, 55 percentage. And moreover, I think that currently the really, really main driver for this is not only that they had a fantastic Q2, but also obviously because they are so close to Tesla, right? You see this big, big, and we're diving later on in the vlog uh, why and how it correlates to Tesla stock, but the Tesla phenomena is obviously giving NEO the stage to perform, right? I mean, people are seeing, okay, Tesla stock has, you know, all this potential built already in the stock, they think so, but Tesla has much more with batteries, solar and all these other things. But uh, NEO is this fresh newcomer so much if they just can have half of the a crazy success that Tesla has with their 400 billion market cap, then this stock with 21 or $22 billion can still, you know, 20 times their value. So this is the thinking of so many out there. And I think, you know, it's nothing wrong to think like that, obviously, but uh, obviously, you know, to, to compare Tesla to another company is very, very difficult guys. Okay. So Tesla is for once a super, great managed company with so many different products and so many fantastic products, such a fantastic brand worldwide. They invented the modern electric vehicle, in my personal opinion, right? With the over the air update, with the battery system to invest into the battery production, with the gigafactories around the world to go first into China. You know, all of this major pioneering steps, something like this just to copy is a little bit, you know, not that revolutionary as, uh, you know, Tesla itself. And therefore, you know, be cautious because Tesla is a totally different game here, okay? If they are at level 20, then uh, Neo is at level two in my personal opinion, okay? So anyway, so let's have a look into the further chart. So over the last three months, we could gain about 334%. This is absolutely insane. Let on you will see why it's even more insane how much new went up in the last couple of weeks so you know currently if you're looking into the chart it's it's obviously in one direction only <laughs> and this is up but uh, don't forget they had you know, one of a very, very bullish time when they came on the stock market, right? I mean, uh, back in September 2018, there were already, you know, super flying high, uh, you know, starting with six, going up to 12, so almost 100%. And then uh, through, you know, numbers that was, wasn't was so great, uh, they lost uh, up to 82% of their value. So uh, be careful here because, uh, you never know when the, you know, fan boyish uh, gain on the stock will uh, burst. And uh, I'm very, very sometimes concerned when stocks go so fast, so high. So I think, you know, and this we will discuss at the next point. In blue, we have Tesla and in black, we have Neo. And uh, we know that there is a saying that Chinese companies like to copy, but since when they are copying stock charts, okay? I mean, this looks almost like a one-to-one -one copy of a stock chart, okay? So this is now year to date. So this should be the first or the 
the 1st of January, it's not, but however, <laughs> uh, so now it should be, yeah, so the 2nd of January, as you can see here, and then we saw that the stock, you know, it's almost like the new stock is following, so you see, the stock of Tesla went a little bit up, the new stock went down, but then kept on following, then the Tesla stock had an amazing increase and then it uh, all came to a crash, obviously in the March situation, right? And then it seems here that the Tesla stock was a little bit more popular, but here it's like a one-to-one, -one, okay? So it, it, it grow here with the huge gain of Tesla, then Tesla had a, like a sideways position until let's say from the 10th of July until the 10th of August, so for a month. The new was a little bit uh, more profit taking, I would say, like you can see here. And then, you know, basically on the same day almost, just like uh, two days after, the, the new stock exploded, right? Just because this last gain here, okay, it's only the news about the stock split. And, you know, why NEO is following here? And this is actually the, I would say the most biggest problem with NEO stock, okay? That I believe that the gain, a lot of the gain is correlated so much to Tesla stock that once Tesla stock has, because of Tesla stock news, has a bump, new stock will have also a bump, okay? So not only you have to be aware about all the new news, but also all the Tesla news, because if if Tesla going down, new will go down. So this is <laughs> quite of a double game here, right? So, but what really is quite of scary, how much, Tesla gained and uh, how much potentially there could be room for grow for NEO, okay? So here we have the one year chart now. So here again, we see the nice correlation, but here you see that the NEO chart or the NEO stock just gained about 600 percentage and uh, Tesla could gain 900 percentage. And the market is so crazy right now, okay? That people think, well, I still have 300% to, you know, catch up with Tesla stock. Well, this is not how the market actually works. So this is a super interesting to see that it's really so much correlated. And, um, but the last few days, obviously, new stock just over perform Tesla stock here, as you can see, you know, especially in the last few days, in the six days where we gained about 50%. This is obviously insane, guys, insane uh, stock movements, but that's, that's stocks 2020, right? I mean, we see day traders like Dave uh, from Barstool Sports. I don't know if you know this guy, but uh, this guy is also funny, very much, you know, profiting from the huge volatility on the market. It will stay very very interesting guys okay and I hope this video will give you just a perspective how crazy new stock currently is so the conclusion of this video is quite simple but before we diving into I would like to present you today's sponsor of this video well, I, I don't have one. So actually you can join our membership here. It's something like Patreon if you are subscribing to the first tier, the Wolfpack Gold, because then you support this channel. Then the second gives you even access to our Discord chat and the third gives you even a one-on-one with me. So we can chat over social media or direct message in Discord or we can chat over email about your ideas, your stock, your portfolio, you will get one-on-one -on -one with me, real, real one-on-one -on -one with me, guys. It's, it's like a mentorship for people out there that, you know, looking for some second opinion and, you know, I'm doing this professionally so I can for sure give you the one or the other idea. Obviously, this is not financial advice. This is just for entertainment, for information and for educational process only. And therefore, I would love, love, when when you join today or tomorrow whenever you decide check it out the join button below all my videos and live streams now in the conclusion i would like to tell you something general okay so if a stock doesn't matter if it's neo doesn't matter if it's uh, nikola if it's tesla if the stock goes up in six days 50 percent this is absolutely unsustainable i know 
the products of Neo are fantastic. I mean, look at those videos, how the cars look like, the paint is fantastic, the reviews of the car is unbelievable, the respectance of the brand in China is there, and Neo is just, you know, having so many nice things other than Tesla as well, right? But still, so much gain in so short time is not sustainable okay and therefore be always careful i would uh, you know see that you check out how you could save your 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 current gains you know maybe you work with stop losses especially i, I usually say don't work with stop losses if you are anyway every day with your phone in your hand but uh, you know if the stock goes so much high and it's only anyway just a, just a speculation stock for you then you know you should definitely work with stop losses here just in case uh, we will have a correction of 30 or 50 percent which can happen if uh, the stock went so much high and went so hot right other than that uh, make sure if you are really believing into neo and the long term story then make sure to do this and and don't get scared out of fluctuations into the stock because this will happen definitely in the next couple of weeks or the next couple of months the stock will you know go even higher and it will fall and correct to a level where you say wow this hurts in my account before i saw you know a six figure number or a five figure number and now i see a five figure number or four figure number this really hurts mentally and therefore you should Always remember that if you're long term in new stock or any other stock, then make sure you gain on those dips by buying more. Don't try to go out and in of the stock because this doesn't work anyway. You cannot time the market. And therefore, I'm super happy if you give me also a like for this video uh, because uh, all of putting those videos together is a lot, a lot of time, but I'm loving it. And therefore, more news video definitely to follow. Mm -hmm.